Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So, the Dragon Ball Hero Celebration has officially begun, and there was so much new stuff that dropped last night that I was honestly having a hard time deciding what to start with today, you know? Because I have like 10 different video ideas in my head. I want to do this event, I want to do the uh, 16 and 21 Extreme Z battle, the Great Sandman 1 and 2 Extreme Z area event, my summoning video for the new Heroes units, which it's killing me that I haven't done already, and uh, also some showcases for the Awakenings and the Extreme Z Awakenings. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, the Chain Battle for uh, Super Genemba is also out, so there's just so much new crap in the game that I was like, what do I do first, right? But ultimately, I decided we'll start with the Dragon Ball Heroes Edition Extreme Z uh, battle because, well, number one, I'm really excited to Extreme Z awaken these guys. But also, once I finish this, then when I do my summoning video, I can get an extra multi with, uh, you know, 350 plus stones. So I think that is the right decision. And uh, before I change my mind and want to do something else, let's just jump right into it. Now, as you can see, we do have the uh, timer above my head for those of you that want to race me to see who can finish all 30 levels the fastest and uh, let me just quickly jump into the level here and we got uh, a lot of Super Saiyan 4 Vegito friends which is ideal so let's grab this guy first and this is the team we're gonna go with today the weakness for this uh, event is the Dragon Ball Heroes category so obviously if you can bring a full Dragon Ball Heroes team and uh, with that said, guys, let's get ready in three, two, one, go. All right. So first level, I don't remember exactly what the progression of the enemies is, but we are facing Toa first. So let's throw Super Saiyan 4 Broly in the front. I think he will be able to solo her by himself because he is... <laughs> White the monster, yeah. 4.6 mil. And he did... F is that right? Is my game glitched? Is the is the attack stat glitch like happening again? Because <laughs> that seemed a little bit too... Too much. I mean, I was expecting him to hit hard. Don't get me wrong. But we just did... 16 million damage okay okay so on this rotation nobody links which is fine you know we're still gonna do some good damage um but damn man i was not expecting super saiyan 4 broly to do that much and wow okay so a lot less but still really really good damage i mean it's gonna be interesting to see at what point do we stop one-shotting uh the enemies I mean, as long as we keep getting, um, you know, Broly or Vegito, then we might actually be doing this for a while. This this might be going for a while. So now we are facing Baby Janemba, and uh, I'm going to say it's going to be a one-shot again. So no support this time. So instead of 4.6, we get 3.5, but we're still doing close to 8 million damage without a crit. So there you have it, guys. If you have Super Saiyan 4 Broly... I mean, I don't have to tell you, um, you gotta use him, man, you gotta use him. One thing I am actually really concerned about is the fact that we might run out of uh, Vegito friends, in which case we could do, um, well, there's Fu, but I don't think a lot of people would use Fu as a friend lead. Man, they need to really fix the friend system, like even version Z on on JP did not do anything to the friend system. You know, as 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 much as like I enjoy all the updates, as much as I think that the auto mode is freaking awesome, right? Like the fact that you can auto like basically play most stages in the game at this point. That's really good. It's like a nice feature to have. But the number one most requested feature, right? The number one most complained about aspect of the game. Is still the same. They still did not change anything about the friend system, which is just absurd to me. I mean, it really is. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. 
I mean, like, they, they must have, they must know, right? Bandai and Akatsuki. Oh, we did not one-shot. Did not one-shot there. Okay. Um, yeah, Bandai slash Akatsuki must be fully aware of the fact that, like, everybody wants an update to the friend system. Everybody wants the friend system to get better. And they didn't do anything with it. And, you know, when they talked about a second part to version Z where, like, they're bringing more updates in the future, there was really no mention of the friend system from what I can tell, you know, like from what I saw at least, you know, they, they didn't say we're going to change the friend system in the future, uh, which is a little bit strange. It's a little bit upset. Oh, hold on. You know, I didn't realize that uh, we switched over to Boobity. So, I mean, it's fine. It's not like we're going to get killed, but the, the Broly might not hit as hard unless he crits. Additional super. Oh, there we go. Okay, second super. Yo, like this Broly is freaking awesome because every super hits so hard and he can do multiple, multiples. I think up to. F Wait, hold on. Is it up to four supers or three supers? It's honestly been a while since I've used the uh, Dragon Ball Heroes. I mean, I'm about to use it a lot more now with all these Extreme Z Awakenings and Doken Awakenings, but yeah, it's been a while, so I don't remember exactly what Broly does, but I remember he got up to four supers, I think. Anyways, getting back to version Z. They need to do something about the friend system. Like, why is that not a focus for the dev team? It doesn't make any sense to me, guys. It really makes no sense at all. Yo, I love this uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Vegeta rotation. Probably one of my favorite in the game, honestly. But uh, there we go, level 7, we're getting through this pretty quick. I really haven't ha had to think about it too much. I'm still worried that we will eventually run out of Vegito's. Um, I'm trying to think who else is a Dragon Ball Heroes lead. Hold on, isn't uh, isn't the Xeno Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Vegeta, aren't they also leaders for Dragon Ball Heroes? Or is it something else like Goku's family? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll worry about it if it comes to that, I guess. You know, if we actually run out of Vegito's, for now, we're doing good. For now, you know, people on our friends list have been coming through. But there might come a point, and if I have to look for alternatives, then it's going to take more time. It's going to make me slower. It's going to cut into my final time, which uh, is not, it's not good. It's not good. Yo, we only have two Vegito's there. Like, that's a problem gonna be a problem okay level nine uh let's do Vegito there unfortunately we don't link with either of the supports but that's fine they're still providing obviously the extra stats so it's basically like having links activated in a way is that a counter there's the counter oh by the way guys while this is happening let me just give a quick shout out to uh, a major sponsor of the channel gamer subs there's their logo, Gamer Subs. If you guys are interested in picking up a waifu cup, shaker cup like this, or one of those uh, awesome waifu shirts or sweaters they just released, they also have these like gamer sleeves, which is not something I like really knew about, but it's kind of interesting. It's basically like, you know, like in basketball, you have like shooting sleeves, right? So basically like that's like a shooting sleeve, but apparently for gamers to, I guess, protect your elbow because it's like always bent and you're moving around a lot, right? When you're gaming, so. Uh, yeah, anyways, gamer cups or shirts or sweaters, obviously they got their supplements too. Uh, if you guys are interested in picking that up, they do have their Black Friday sale going right now. So head down to the link in my description, gamersubs.gg. And for a limited time, you can use my discount code TIGER for 20% off your purchase. Okay, so shout out to gamer, gamer subs, gamers, I almost said gamer cups, similar, but not quite the same. Gamer subs, go check them out. Tiger for 20% off. See, this is going so easy. <laughs> it's so chill right now that I can really talk about whatever and not really have to worry about dying. I don't think we'll actually have to worry about dying at any point in this video. Um, but we'll see. You know, it's still early. It's still early, so maybe it's too, too soon to judge. But I think as long as I can, like... Keep this Broly and Super Saiyan 4 Vegito combo going. 
Um, there's nothing really that can stop us. Like, it, it, it's really... Pretty crazy. Okay, we took 15k there. That's the most damage we've taken so far. By far. And Broly is gonna solo PyCon. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> That damage, man. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, level 12. Let's see. You know, we're still getting a good amount of Vegitos. So it hasn't been too bad so far. Um, I wonder if we're going to have an issue with the 16 and 21 event. I don't even know what the weakness for that event is. I'm guessing androids. Mm, or maybe not. Maybe it's probably like crossover or something like that. I want to say crossover. I haven't I haven't seen it, so I could be completely wrong. But that's just my prediction. That's my guess. By the way, guys, if you have summoned on the hero's banner so far, definitely let me know in the comments uh, how those pulls have gone. I'm curious to see if people are getting lucky, if they're getting you know the units that they wanted. Um, the good thing about the Heroes banner is that you literally have only Heroes units on it, right? Like, you can't pull a random, like, I don't know, AGL Super Saiyan Goku from, like, five years ago, or Tech Super Saiyan Vegeta, or just something like that, right? You can't pull, like, a random SSR on that banner. If you're getting an SSR, it's going to be a Heroes SSR. And that's why, even though... You know, it's not like a Dokkan Fest banner, it's not like there's an LR on the banner or anything like that. These heroes units, or these heroes banners rather, are actually quite good value in my opinion. You know, because you're getting only heroes units, and if you care about Dragon Ball heroes, which obviously, if you're going to be summoning, you do care, right? Then it's, it's a worthy investment, just because you're guaranteed to get heroes units. Like the worst case scenario... If you have the worst possible luck, you're still getting one guaranteed hero's unit per multi. So you can't really get shafted too bad. I mean, knock on wood. <laughs> I, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. You could still like technically get the worst ones. And you could technically get like, you know, the same one over and over again. So I don't want to say you can't get shafted. It's Dokkan. You can always get shafted. Right, it's it's always like the shaft is always on the table. That sounds weird, um, but <laughs> you know what I mean, right? Like, there's no way to not get shafted, but it's very much less likely. It's a lot less likely because they're guaranteed he heroes units, and um, you know, like the, the the chances of you getting the same one over and over again are very low. But nonetheless, still possible. So knock on wood. Okay, I don't want to, you know, mess up anybody's luck. But with that said, long story short, let me know in the comments how those summons are going. I hope you guys are all having some great luck. And uh, this race is, is, is going pretty well. We're 11 minutes in. We're more than halfway there. And even though, you know, I expect it to get harder, I don't think uh, it's going to be that much worse. Even though we get to, like, level 20. 25, level 30. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Hmm. Okay, so we're starting to take some damage. Not a ton, but definitely damage was taken. That was what, like 26k? All right, so maybe by the end, we'll take like 50k for a super or something like that. Now, you guys might have noticed the color on my face is a little bit weird. And it's because uh, I, I was adjusting the like saturation, and, like the color settings on my webcam earlier today. And uh, I think I set it too high. <laughs> I think I put the like saturation a little bit too high. So my face looks like extra red right now. It's a little bit weird. But I'll probably fix it in the next video. We'll just keep playing with it. I don't think it really matters. I don't think people care about how red my face looks. But I care. 
Okay, it matters to me. So I'm trying to see like what the best setting is right now. You know, you know, if I'm if I'm like here, if I'm in the shadow of my of my microphone, then my face looks extra red. But if I move back and I'm here, it actually looks fine. So I'm not really sure what to do. Maybe I should just change my lighting. We need to move my like ring light and like my other, you know, light things, light boxes around. That might be better. Yo, if you guys are like YouTubers and you like or streamers or whatever, and you have some uh, knowledge about good lighting, definitely hit me up. All right, because I am really bad at that stuff. Like I don't really know. It, it's sad because I've been <laughs> I've been doing this for like three, four years, right? I mean, at least like taking it seriously for two years plus, and there's still so much I don't know, man. Like, you know my boy Rawad? He's like my IT guy. Anytime I have like a technical issue <laughs> related to like YouTube or Streamlabs or whatever, uh, I hit this guy up and I'm like, yo, man, I don't know what's happening. I don't know what to do. Please help. And this guy usually like just FaceTime me or like we'll call in Discord and he'll like, you know, sort things out. But yeah, I'm really dumb when it comes to tech, man. It's really quite sad. Um, I need to just like, I don't know, take a crash course or like take some kind of video course on this stuff to learn how to do the very basic things when it comes to like being a content creator. Cause like, I never spent a lot of time on that. I was really more just focused on like, I don't know, making videos, I guess, right? But like the lighting and like the little, the little things that really do matter at the end of the day, never really focused on it too much. So let me know guys, if you got some tips, I'm happy to uh, take them. What level is this? 20? Hmm. Okay, so now we're on level 20. 15 minutes in, not bad. Uh, I'm gonna aim to finish this by 30. I'm gonna say within 30 minutes, we get this done, and then I can go do my summoning video for the new units, which, like I said, man, like I'm dying on the inside. You guys know how much I enjoy summoning, right? And like the fact that I'm not summoning yet after the banner's been out for how long? Uh, 12 hours? Or somewhere around there. Maybe not exactly 12 hours, but like close to 12, like maybe 11 hours at this point. Um, is is just insane, you know, like because I'm I'm so used to just summoning as soon as a banner drops, right? And uh, I haven't been doing that recently, just because, you know, I've been busy with like other things in life, and I've been trying to get good sleep. But because of that, my like my, my timing timeliness, I guess, when it comes to doing summoning videos and and running events and stuff like that, has been kind of kind of off, right? So. For those of you that are upset about that, I do apologize. You know, I know a lot of people are used to me just like being there when celebrations start, when new things start, and I just can't do that anymore at this point. I'm not saying that it'll never happen again, but right now it's just not really realistic for me. So uh, with that said, yeah, I am dying on the inside, man. <laughs> I gotta summon soon. I, I, I gotta summon soon or else there might be a problem. Yo, did I max out the links for my Vegito? Oh, <laughs> I just left Fuse Fighter. I don't know why. Wait, is Broly maxed out? Oh, got a couple links. Okay, so these guys I did put a lot of work into, but they're not quite there. And honestly, man, like when you get to the end, when you get to like a few links that are level nine, or you have like one link that's like lagging behind, it's really hard to uh, motivate yourself to just like keep running that 23-8 stage, right? Because it takes forever to get level 9 to level 10, especially if it's just one link. Like, the chances of that one link increasing is so astronomically low that you're, you're spending, like, 10 stamina bars to get that one link to go up. And it's just, like, it's too hard, man. It's too tedious. So what I'm probably going to do is just, like, for the ones that are, like, really close, just wait until that auto update comes out. Right, and then I'll just use the auto update, uh, like the auto stage, auto battle thing to like go through 23-8, you know, 
on repeat and uh, get those guys to level 10 because I, I just can't do it manually, man. Even, even if I was to do it like while watching a show or something like that, it's still painful. Not gonna lie, like even if I was just watching like The Office, you know, for the, like, the 10th time <laughs> in the background while I was grinding links, I still don't enjoy doing it. Like I just can't, oh. Oh no, oh no. Okay, that was a huge waste of time. Bro, leaving this guy with this this tiny, tiny sliver of HP and I have to watch another animation, get to another rotation before I kill him. <laughs> that sucks, man. That really sucks. All right, we're still making good time though. I said under 30 minutes and we are very much on pace for under 30 minutes. Um, you know what, new goal, 25 minutes, 25, I think we need to be ambitious, we need to be more ambitious, you know, you gotta aim for the stars, if we don't, if we don't hit it, then we'll at least, what was the expression, like aim for the stars and, oh no, 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 no. the expression is aim for the moon, and even if you miss, you'll land amongst the stars, which is a really dumb, <laughs> it's a really dumb saying, I'm not gonna lie. I apologize to anybody that uses it regularly, you know, if it's like your favorite saying or whatever, but it makes no sense because the closest star, well, outside of the moon, I guess, is literally like over a light year away, right? And the moon is like, I don't remember the exact distance actually, uh, is it a couple hundred thousand kilometers? I don't know, like, in the grand scheme of things, compared to, like, how far another star is to us, it's super, super close, you know? So, like, the statement that, like, if you don't reach the moon, you will at least land amongst the stars, this really does not make a lot of sense, you know what I mean? <laughs> but anyways, you know, I don't want to be, like, a, uh, I, I sound like a boomer, man, I sound like an old man, like, <laughs> I'm not, I'm still, I'm still relatively young, guys, you know, I'm still... 26 right now um so maybe i'll just let it go i'll, I'll just let, I'll let this one go i'll stop digging this hole deeper let's just focus on the event we got five more stages and we got about four and a half minutes to get it done which means that we have to average less than a minute per stage um i'm not sure if we can really reasonably get that done but uh, i'm gonna try my best i'm gonna try my best we got a super for the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. It's been kind of hard because he doesn't get a lot of key uh, linked with the Super Saiyan 4s. But this turn, everyone has a super. So hopefully, hopefully get an additional super with Broly first. All oh, these additional normals are not, not what we want, man. Not what we want. Because they take extra time, but they don't do a lot more damage. Or, or that much damage in general. So it's just not worth it. Goku, finish it off, man. Finish it off, please. Come on. Come on, do it. Oh, you... you douchebag. It's okay. One more attack. One more attack. 25 minutes is not looking so good, guys. Not looking so good. Oh, my God. And he's not even gonna count. Oh, he counters. He counters. He counters. Never mind. I didn't see the flash. I didn't see the little like dim of the screen, so I thought there was gonna be no counter, but we got a counter. So we saved a little bit of time there. Okay. Three more, three, no, four more. Yeah, 27, 28, 29, 30, four more. <laughs> Numbers can be hard sometimes, guys. Okay, here we go. This is not a good rotation. <laughs> this is not a good rotation. I don't have any of our heavy, heavy hitters on this, uh, Rotation right now. <sighs> Alright, let's go. <sighs> Nervous, man. I'm trying to get under 25 minutes. I don't think we will be able to, but I really want it. I really want it. Here we go. Rolling the front, Vegito in the middle. 
and Vegeta at the end. That's going to be a super for him. There we go. Hopefully, we don't have to get to Vegeta. Broly can maybe just crit once, and I think he's dead. There we go. Two minutes. <laughs> Three levels. <laughs> can we do it? I'm going to say no. I have last hope, guys. Yo, it's so dope to see, like, these new heroes units on my friend list. And it makes me extra sad that I don't have one right now. But we will very soon. No doubt we will have a, uh, at least one of them very soon. I, I feel like we're going to get at least two or three in today's video. And I'll probably come back for a second summon just to complete the set. Um, as I've said multiple times, right? Like, my goal at this point is not to rainbow uh, new units. It's just to get one copy of each. Uh, the unfortunate thing is, you know, this time we have five, so <laughs> it still might take quite a few stones to get all of them. Um, but because of the guaranteed SSR system, because it's only, you know, heroes units, uh, we could get lucky and get all at least one copy of each within, you know, like 300 to 500 stones, which uh, would be awesome. That 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 would be legit. That would be very legit. Alright, so we're definitely not going to get 25 minutes. <laughs> we got 40 seconds. But under 30 minutes is a guarantee. Uh, maybe 27-ish? 27 sounds reasonable. We got one-ish, one and a half minute for each one. For the remaining two stages, that is. 29 right now. Here we go. Yeah. I'm going to say 26 minutes and 45 seconds. Is where we're gonna end up uh oh no oh we're good okay i thought i thought the vegeta needed more key and i thought i should have gotten the you know fizz orbs but it didn't make a difference it actually ended up being okay so that's fine fortunately no broly here so this stage is gonna take a little bit longer than it really has to unless vegeto can give us a nice additional super on this turn come on no additional okay and no counter either okay okay all right broly do your thing man do your thing let's go finish it up finish it up i guess if you wanted to get like really in depth with the uh, racing and stuff you would know like exactly how long each super attack animation for each of your units is so that you can like optimize you know, like, if you only need one more attack, who to use for that attack? Like, maybe if I knew that, like, Super Saiyan 3 Goku had a shorter attack animation than Broly, which I don't know for a fact, but if I did know that, maybe I would have used Super Saiyan 3 Goku instead of Broly, right? But no, it's not that serious. <laughs> that's a little bit going, that's, that's going a little bit too far, I think. It's not that serious. But let's just try to get it within 26 minutes. 45 seconds, I'm ready to stop the timer any minute now. Hopefully, uh, Broly can do his thing, get us two supers. Give me one more, come on, Broly, come on, do it! <sighs> Broly let us down, it's okay, we got Vegito. We're still on good pace here. Okay, it looks like it's gonna be Toa. Demon Goddess Toa that does it, come on. Boom, KO, and we're good. Yo, I got it exactly, well, you know, a few milliseconds off, but almost exactly on the dot, man. 26 minutes, 45 seconds to the final KO screen, which is where you stop the race. That's how it goes, right? So, <sighs> there you go, guys. Not a bad time, if I do say so myself. Not a bad time. There you have it. All 30 levels done. We could go further, but we don't have to right now. There's no point. We just need to, uh, wow, we have to do a lot of uh, steps for the Extreme Sea Awakening. That's annoying, because on JP, you can do all the steps, I think, in one go. Or is that for the second part of the update? I don't remember exactly, to be honest, but the point is, we need version Z soon. We need version Z, Z, Z. version Z on global sooner than later please bandai just 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 give it to us we need it anyways uh that's gonna be today's video guys 
46 minutes, 45 seconds. Uh, let me know how you guys did, if you did decide to race me. Obviously, tell me your polls so far in the comments down below. And uh, yeah, expect more videos uh, later this, this evening, I guess, or not evening, this afternoon, and maybe into the evening, because I have so many videos I want to do that it might just be like five drops throughout the day. Stay tuned, guys. Thank you so much for watching, though. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Final reminder, check out Gamer Subs for awesome waifu shakers like this. Sub to the channel if you're new, and also hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.